welcome back if you're new to my channel my name is Zipline I'm one of the beauty influencer I do a lot of makeup videos product reviews and all that other jazz for you all so today's video I'm actually going to do my full face makeup using she glad products everything is she glad every single thing so <laughs> if you want to see how if you are curious to see some of the products from she glam and you haven't tried it and you want me to show you guys or you wanted to see how it looks on camera or how it performs on the face this is the video for you because I'm going to be doing whole face using she glam so if you want to see how I created this beautiful Valentine's Day kind of sample glam uh, just carry on watching this video uh, but before you leave don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so every time I'm posting a video you will get a notification uh, so yeah let's just not waste any more time and get into this video so I can show you how to glam yourself a bit this look love you all take care bye My beauties so here we go we are going to begin with the tutorial uh, so first thing first I'm going to use my she glam birthday skin primer and this is the original formula which is for dry skin for hydration it helps to fill your pores and it does give your skin a bit of a glow so I really really like this one it's my favorite um, because it works really well for my skin type so I really like it first thing first I'm going to just basically apply this all over my face and where I have more pores I'd like to press this primer right into my skin so it fills the pore as well for a bit of a color correcting I'm using this a she glam versatile concealer and this concealer comes in many 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 colors and I just picked up the color orange and I'm just gonna use a, uh, this concealer to color correct I have to say one thing though this concealer is a very thick in consistency so the little amount goes a long way so when you use this particular concealer from she glam don't apply it too much because it's 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 not gonna be a really nice look so a very small amount and then you just need a good blending brush to blend this whole out and I'm just using my, uh, I believe this one is Morphe concealer brush or Zoeva, but I'll write down in the description box below. For foundation, we are going with She Glam hydrating foundation because I'm a dry skin type, so I'm using a hydrating foundation. But if you are an oily skin type, you use their um, previous formula, which is more matte. Uh, so it gives you a more like a matte finish. I personally like this one I like that one too but this one goes really well with my skin type and it does make my skin look super duper glowy and radiant um, I'm using a flat foundation brush to apply my foundation I'm just trying this new technique basically for foundation application and I quite seem to like it and hence the reason I'm using the flat one you can use beauty blender you can use uh, like more dense uh, foundation brush whichever one you like as long as it gives you a nice flawless finish <laughs> um, to give my face a hydration I'm going to apply this facial mist from Hero Hero Wonder it's a bamboo facial mist I apply this quite a bit during the whole makeup process um, this is a Sigma foundation brush it's just a, a, a no product or anything on this brush I just used to blend my mist with my foundation for my contour bronzer i'm using she glam liquid bronzer and i'm using this all over basically wherever i want to be more chiseled and contoured and i try actually a new contour technique as well i kind of like it uh, but i'll give you more <laughs> details on the new things i'm trying i'll be making a new video like updated routine or something very soon now i'm using my uh, zoeva buffer brush this is my favorite brush to blend my contour because i feel like it it gives me a really nice chiseled um, finish and I personally really like it so I'm just basically blending all my uh, liquid bronzer or you can use contour uh, they do she glam does have a 
cream contours as well actual cream and uh, powder contour formulas as well but i only had this one so i just used this and it worked really well actually if i have to pick one and this probably would be the product i'll pick to do contour and bronzer from she glam because it is a really good formula it's same as their liquid blush uh, and it blends really really nicely and very easily um i'm using an eyeshadow brush to blend out my nose contour i always use an eyeshadow brush because they are more like slim and easy to work with for my brightening i'm using the same versatile concealer from she glam and the shade i'm using is fizzy which is they don't have many shades when it comes to in this particular concealer range they have few but not many darker shades they have a lot of pale or lighter shades but not many dark shades so this works really well for me um if your foundation is a little bit yellow in tone means like a little bit darker than your skin tone and you want to balance out everything they have a really good color options in this particular concealer which are much lighter so you can really balance the whole thing out so i'm basically applying the concealer everywhere i usually like to be brightened oh my god my nose is getting blocked now <laughs> and uh, i'm using my flower beauty concealer brush to uh, basically blend all my concealer I have to say this is the brush I bought by accident but I am literally in love with this brush right now it's so it's like the shape of this brush is so perfect um I'm actually thinking about buying more brushes from Flower Beauty because the the the, the actual quality of the brush is really really good and I it's so easy to work with and it just blends everything really nicely If you hearing some background noises please please avoid because is this happens to me every time i want to do the voice over my kids decided to do everything at the same time so my dog my child everybody wants to do the everything around me so uh there we go we just uh, blending still blending my brightening my concealer i wanted to give you this particular tutorial a little bit in detail a little bit more i, I, for, I was I know the video is going to be around 15 minutes or so but you can skip it if you want because it's I just but I still wanted to show you how I'm actually blending my highlight and contour so it how I get that particular face shape what you see right at the end and you all seem to love it so I just wanted to show you Anyway so I'm just going in between the uh, bronzer brush and the concealer brush now just to make sure I have everything nicely blended and everything is still looking good and nice for blush i'm going to use my she glam liquid blush we all know that is such a popular product this is this is one of the products which she glam literally knew like when you talk about she glam you will automatically think about this blush so these are really really good blushes they are really good formulas and the shade i'm using is a rose ritual so i when i started filming this video i didn't know what i want to like do for my eyes and everything so i was kind of going with the flow and this color of the blush really i just i like i like this color it's one of my favorites from their all of the um uh, liquid blush colors they came out with so i just went ahead with this and kind of just you will see later how i just matched everything <laughs> um for to set everything in place i'm using she glam setting powder and i'm using this one in shade natural linen which you can say translucent as well because it's like literally no color uh so um i'm going to basically do my like once one more time go over my concealer so there's no creases before i set my under eye area with the setting powder i'm using a tarty beauty puff ignore that because i know you guys cannot purchase this anymore but unfortunately i have it and i love it and i'm still using it but i'm in the i'm actually in the hunt of finding a new puff to recommend to you all of you guys and i i have a couple of good um options so but i'm going to be placing a order soon and i'll let you know which one which other ones i like but right now i'm using the tarty beauty one and because i really 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 like this puff <laughs> for the highlighter i'm using she glam cosmic highlighter i think that's the only highlighter i have from she glam and this one is in shade champagne no like regrets or anything i bought this myself and i like it it's it's really nice it kind of uh, remind me of maybelline chrome highlighter it's it's really good quality still 
gives me the really nice glow um, and I'm actually doing this uh, for this particular video I actually applied it even on the high points of my face like on my cheeks usually I don't do it anymore but I just wanted to show you so for the eye look I'm actually going to use a she glam modern love eyeshadow trio this is one of the this is one of the new items they have on their website as part of their Valentine's Day collection um, this uh, trio has three different colors one is matte and two one is more shimmer and another one is more glittery so I'm taking the first shade which is more matte and it's it's called say bye or something um, I'll write down all the shades in the description box below so basically I'm picking up the matte shade from the trio and I'm just applying this as my transition and kind of like a helping color for my shimmer um, and I'm blending this with my Morphe eyeshadow brush now I'm taking the second shade which is more shimmery and I'm going to apply this all over my lid creating kind of like a wing but not using the brushes or anything just going to take this um, eyeshadow wand to create it you can definitely create a really nice wing by just with this wand you really don't need any brushes or anything because you kind of do like extending your lid area a little bit out so you really don't need a proper eyeliner brush you can make a really nice shape just with this one and it's a really nice shade it i like the formula of the um eyeshadow it was really easy to work with if i have to pick from this whole trio these two shades what i just applied probably would be my favorite shade third one was okay but i felt like it as soon as i applied it on my eye it kind of like became a bit patchy um maybe I should have used a different eye base or something but anyway uh, by the way I didn't show you guys my brows on camera because I literally don't have any brow product from she glam so I actually end up using my benefit uh, which pencil did I use a benefit one of the benefit uh, brow pencils <laughs> um, now I'm just taking that uh, shimmer shade and I applied it in the inner corner of my eye and as you can see probably new york i don't know how much camera is picking up or not but as soon as i applied it it kind of like a conflict with my eye base and it moved my eye base around a bit but still it's okay i might have to play around with it now i'm just using the same matte shade i used as a transition on my lower lash line to just give a bit of a dimension to my lower lash line and i'm just blending this using a pencil brush and um, most of the brushes i use for my eye look is from either zoeba or morphe um curl my lashes used my and another thing i don't have any she glam mascaras <laughs> so i went ahead and used my maybelline one the new colossal mascara and because i kind of liking it that right that one right now for lashes i'm using my own lash brand i'm pretty girl lashes in style pretty me i didn't want it a super dramatic lashes i didn't want it a super natural lashes i just wanted a kind of like a in between which give me more of a glam look without looking like I'm wearing really really heavy lashes so this lash style is my favorite for that kind of look now I'm using the same cosmic highlighter to highlight my brow bone and also the inner corner of my eyes um, to do my waterline I'm using Rimmel uh, again I didn't had any eye pencils from <laughs> she gloves I'm using my Rimmel eye pencil in a shade nude because um, I wanted to make my eyes look bigger so I use the nude if you want to make it like you can use brown or black as well now I'm drenching my face with so here you go guys this is the final look using the whole she glam products i hope you enjoyed this video and you like this look if you like this look don't forget to hit that thumbs up so i know you like it and if you have any questions feel free to ask me in the comment section below and i'm happy to answer all your questions and if you're wondering my hair is looking like this there's a part two for it go and watch it love you all take care bye guys